Hey everyone, today we're going to do a how to clean a flathead. A lot of guys I see have some videos and they skin them and do stuff like that. I personally, all the, between all the red meat that's in between the skin and the meat, I personally think skinning them is kind of just a waste of time. So I'm going to show you guys how I do it. Everybody does it different, but this is the way I do it. Start by pretty much feel for the two bones right here behind the gill plate. Come in, make a cut, go down the dorsal fin, follow the spine like any normal fish. Follow the ribs all the way down to the base of the ribs. And come in and you feel on the, you can kind of see that bone and the pectoral fin. Come in all the way up along the belly meat. Make a cut all the way around. the other side because you're going to need to do the same on the other side. But now, slimy. When I get to the base of these ribs, I come in underneath the ribs. Now, this side, do the same. Now when you get down to the bottom of the ribs again, just come right underneath them. And that is every piece of meat on that flathead, minus the head steaks. So now, come through and use the electric flay knife and I float it just high up off the red meat. So you just float a little bit of meat off and all that red comes off. You just clean up the lateral line then, you'll slice down. And that whole filet, I'll throw it in a bowl, soak it in water for a couple hours and that thing will be bleach white when I get done with it. All blood comes right on. Uh, so, I'll show you how to do all these. And
Some people leave the silver skin on, I take it off. It just has a weird texture to it, I think. And that is your belly meat. Put that in the bowl. Slab of belly meat. Same thing with the filet. Oh, this one's already done. Like I said, I'll clean off a little bit of the silvery skin there, and then, like I said, just I'll come in to trim this. I'll clean out the ladder line. Other than that, that one's done. And then same here. I'll a little strip on the back. Off. see where I didn't float and it's got that layer of red meat and you can see where I floated the knife just up an eighth inch or so and leave all the red meat right on the skin that's the reason I don't th I don't think it's necessary to skin your catfish because then you leave all this muddy tasting red meat on and you got to trim it all off afterwards so that's why I do it with the skin on take out the head stakes show you that you can pretty much feel right in through here there's a bone that lies out comes together and goes in right behind the eyes you pretty much can't mess this up by feel you just poke your knife in and follow the bone Don't cut all the way through the skin. You can take your thumb and you can peel this meat right off the skin without having to skin it. And there's the head steak nuggets. And now there's not an ounce of meat left on that fish anywhere. That's how I skin a flathead. Hope that helped. And now we're gonna have ourselves a nice little flathead fry. Got ourselves two nice little flatheads in that bowl. We're gonna go soak them up in some water, put them in the fridge, and like I said, and let them soak for two, four hours, or even just overnight, and they'll be all bleach white 
and ready to chunk up and deep fry. So stay tuned. We're going to keep bringing you some more fish cleaning videos. Hope you like this one.